People from across the country are heading out east as the Pope continues that journey through America. After Washington, D.C., the Pope will head to New York and Philadelphia. Some local students are heading out east today, and our Bridget Shanahan is live with them on Milwaukee's east side. Hi, Bridget. Good morning, Vincent Susan. Yeah, this latest group to head out east is just another example of the Pope's appeal to young people. These young women all stayed here on the east side last night at this Patawa residence here. Just moments ago, they came out and loaded up their van, and now they're at mass in the chapel behind this building, getting ready for their big trek to New York, trying to catch a glimpse of Pope Francis if they can do it. They're all riding in this van together. It's a 15-seat van, so space is going to be a little cramped. 15 of these girls are all going together. The youth group does service Saturdays where they give back to the Milwaukee community in a different way every month and they say Pope Francis who's known as the people's Pope is their inspiration for that and it's their small way of bringing his message to Milwaukee and many of them feel a special connection to the Pope he puts so much emphasis on acts of kindness the girls are all piling into this van bound first for Central Park to see the papal procession and then it's down to Philly to go to the world meeting of family events and if you're wondering just how long it will take these folks to drive all the way to New York City, about 13 or 14 hours, but they're not going to have much time to sightsee along the way, but the girls say they're going to plan three-minute mini tours in each state that they pass along the way, and as soon as they got in mass here, we're going to be speaking with them before they get into the van and head off at about 6.45 this morning, so stay with us on Live at Daybreak at 6.30 to hear directly from them. Live in Milwaukee this morning, Bridget Shanahan, today's TMJ4. All right, Bridget, thank you. And here's a look at the Holy Father's schedule for today. As day begins at the Capitol, where he will be addressing that joint session of Congress, and then he'll visit St. Patrick's Catholic Church in D.C. Pope Francis then moves on to New York City for an evening prayer service at St. Patrick's Cathedral. And we'll continue to provide you coverage of the Pope's visit on air and online. You can head to TMJ4.com for updates throughout the day. It's